At first, I was hesitant. It was something that seemed to be uh, off the wall for me. Because a prophet in today's world, you know, that's something that you read about in the Bible, you know, something, you know, Moses did, Elijah did. But today, you know, in 2013, uh, you know, I, I, I was skeptical. I was very skeptical about calling the number. But I first met the Master Prophet in Charlotte, North Carolina. And it was kind of different to see him in person than on TV because you had that face-to-face -face contact. You know, you get to see that he's a real person, not just an you know, imaginary cartoon character. But he's an actual person that can speak things into your life that would change the way you think about things. And once I met him and he opened up my eyes to certain things that were happening to me, it, it brought about clarity and enlightenment. He spoke a word about education about something that's where I need to be in. And this is my second year pursuing my bachelor's degree. And I can see how he said that now because I'm really enjoying school. Um, matter of fact, I travel a three hour round trip just to get to my classes uh, in Charlotte. So it's kind of like, you know, something that I know is gonna pay off in the long run. The knowledge that I'm receiving is something that, you know, I'm treasuring. It's something that I know is gonna be with me for a long time. The Master Prophet, he showed me how things can be better for me if I do go to school. But it wasn't a direction I originally planned to go into because I think college was a waste of time, a waste of money, you, you be in debt, you have to be reading all the time, and you just miserable, won't have time for family life. But after pursuing and walking in that word, it showed me how it's going to eventually pay off, and it's paying off. And that is the power of prophecy.